Hey YouTube, today I'll be showing you guys a cool trick that you can use on your iPhone or iPad that will let you block most ads throughout your phone. So that includes anything on the web, some in apps, and uh, yeah that's pretty much it. But it's still pretty useful. Uh, since you can't install third party ad blockers, the way we're going to do this is by changing the DNS settings and that only works over Wi-Fi. You can't change your um, 3G DNS settings so you can only do this so the trick only works over when you're on Wi-Fi. So, got my phone over here and I got this website. So this website you need to go to is called adbarricade.com and right down here is the DNS settings. Uh, so what you need to do is go over to your phone, go into settings click on Wi-Fi up the top there and then find your preferred Wi-Fi network and click on the little blue arrow next to it and then right here under DNS settings or DNS um, that is where you're gonna put your DNS number that's over here from the website now if you already have numbers there you'll wanna put this number before them and then put a comma or you can just delete them if that doesn't work and then just put this make sure you save the DNS numbers though if, um, if they're not provided automatically by your Wi-Fi network uh, so yeah so there you go put that in there and now if I were to go to a website uh, let's do New York Times you'll see that there was an ad right there there was an ad right there and right there you saw them just as the page loaded but then they disappeared so there you go ads gone and for an example of it working in an app I found that uh, this app by Red Foundry I can has cheeseburger app it has uh, it works it'll block the ads in here so every uh, I think um, like six or seven See, there'd be an ad right here on the seventh page, uh, but it blocks it. Still puts a page there, of course, but there's no ad. So, there you go. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, helps you out. If you have any questions, send me a PM or a comment in the, the comments of this video. And if you guys want to see how I put these videos together, um, or what, I, what apps I use to record my screen and record my phone screen, uh, I'll be making a video later that uh, will walk through the steps that you can take to do it yourself. Uh, and don't forget to subscribe and like it. Thanks, guys. I'll see you next time.